Best brawler to win the solo showdown dark passage shark edition. Let's go. For the obvious know the drill, for the newcomers, hi, I'm Greed Echo Live, and I record daily Brawl Stars content as of now on the best brawlers in different solo showdown maps. So yeah, let's go into the first round right here. And also, thank you guys so much for your support to got me to 200 subscribers for this channel. And I truly, truly appreciate it. Because I've actually set up this goal back in March, and within three months, we have actually achieved it. So yeah, thank you guys so much for that. And you know what that means? We are heading to 300 subscribers. So yeah, <coughs> let's go. So I'm actually aiming to hit it, to hit 300 subscribers in December, which is, which is my birthday month. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so just now my talking may be a little bit disturbed because um, because I've ate something that is like nuts, but then it's stuck, kind of stuck in my throat. So yeah, can't really talk things clearly. But anyway, I'm back here right now. So just now I've said thank you so much for letting me hit 200 subscribers before the end of June even comes. So it's just halfway at june so i've got top three but it doesn't really matter so anyway thank you guys so much for 200 subscribers so you know what that means we're heading to 300 subscribers go which i hope to hit it before october kind of as a birthday gift for me because my birthday month is at september and it's towards the end of the september which is definitely a good timing for me to hit another 100 subscribers um so yeah, this channel's progress has been great and my channel's shots and content has been getting solid performance as well. So when I check back the backend analytics, it is definitely shocking to see that um, all of the views that I've got for this year compared to last year is completely different and I'm totally happy about it. So yeah, let's focus on this. And by the way, if you guys are into other brawlers as well, feel free to go to my channel and search the keyword dark passage or just any other solo showdown maps, and you're gonna get a bunch of other brawlers in your way to help you out. So yeah, let's go into this right here. Wow, we're already halfway there. So yeah, it's kind of funny at the start because as I say, I've, I'm stuck uh, with my throat right there with some of the uh, nuts that I've ate um, just not so long ago. But anyway, I've drank a sip of water and I'm back. So yeah, I'm just gonna stay here as I don't have any power-ups, which is the um, the badge on whether I stay passive or active. Normally, if I have three or more power-ups, I would most probably stay active. But for this situation, I'm low in HP, low in damage. I would not prefer to go out there and just um, give some wild shots to other people with higher power-ups. So yeah, I'm just gonna wait. Let's see what he does. So we've got Dog and um, Bodhi right here. Okay, so I've got top three for this round. Definitely okay with that once again, as I don't have any power ups right here, but I'm still talking and it's still getting a great result. So sometimes if you don't have any sufficient power ups, feel free to just stay and look around before going to another attack. Cause sometimes you don't know, you never know that staying passive can give you a much better result compared to having no power ups and rush out and brawl. That would not be a great plan to have. Um, Especially if you're starting out in the early ranks like what I'm doing right now Because uh, for most of my brawlers most of the time I would start from scratch when I'm learning it to now master it after I've finished the series And this is kind of like a like the true intent that I'm doing The true intention I'm doing is not to really show off my skills of how good I am But to also go through this journey with you guys from when you're not so good to when you're getting better to now you're getting good at it so yeah, if you compare my gameplay from 2022 to now, you would see a huge difference um, between the videos that I've done this year and also two years ago. 
So it really shows the progression that you're doing for each brawler and each series. And Brawl Star really does have a lot of content to ship from. You can have solo shootout maps, um, create a match, um, and also a lot of other game modes that you can explore once a new update occurs. So yeah, it's just a super, super nice um, place for you to create content and I'm enjoying it as well. So yeah, let's see what we can do right here. So we're into the safety net once again and this is so funny as this video is meant to be celebrating 200 subscribers but then um, I didn't really make the process move at the start due to my voice at the start. So yeah. Oh wow. So yeah, I'm into top 3 right now. Without doing anything, essentially, this video is just me talking to you guys. It's kind of like a little update where I just show a gameplay. It's kind of like, this video is kind of like B-roll. Like the gameplay is like the B-rolls that people normally do. And I'm just updating you guys on this. Okay. Oh wow, so I've got top 2 for this round. Definitely okay with that and I'm happy with that as I only got one power. And you know what, for the final quest I'm just gonna try to deal any significant damage towards this brawler if possible. So yeah. Okay, I've dealt some damage and I'm happy with that. So, oh even more damage. So. Okay, I'm happy I can live peacefully right now and end this video. So yeah, super happy with you got to get this result. Everything within top three or near top three. So yeah, really, really nice result right here. So let's see what rewards we have got right here, which is some XP doublers and also one more reward right here, which is some coins. So 28 trophies in three rounds is not a bad result at all. So basically this will be the video, guys. Comment down below what the other brawlers you're using in Solo Shoto Dark Passage and also subscribe for similar content like this. And I'm going to see you guys in my next video. Peace out.